were your first thoughts, Mo, when you got the call from the, from the Redskins? You know, I first looked at my agent and said, it's a 703 number, who is that? And he's like, pick it up. So I picked it up, and uh, it was Coach Gruden, you know, and uh, it was exciting because I, you know, I met with those guys you know, about two, three weeks ago, and I felt like it was a great vibe, you know, very relaxed. Um, but it's a blessing, you know, being able to be two hours away from home, you know, uh, training camp in my hometown, Richmond, Virginia, and uh, being able to block alongside of uh, a Pro Bowl tackle, Trent Williams, you know, I'll be in his back pocket all the time, learning from the best. <laughs> What did they say to you on the phone? What was the message like? Do you remember it all? Talk, talk <laughs> about your emotions that you were overwhelmed with. You know, I kind of uh, answered the phone a little skeptical, you know, like, uh, hey, uh, hello, who is this? And he's like, this coach Jay Gruden. He's like, you've been waiting for this phone call for a while, huh? I said, yeah, man. And, you know, I uh, got a little emotional on the phone. And, uh, you know, I just, man it's, a, man, it's a blessing. I'll just be able to have that, have that phone call, put that hat on, walk across the stage, shake the commissioner hand, and then, uh, you know, meet, London Fletcher in the middle of the stage. Uh, man, it's a blessing. Um, you know, for me, you know, uh, you know, I, I was here the first day, here all, all day today, and, um, you know, I didn't let it bother me. You know, I, I said, you know, God has a plan for everybody, and, uh, you know, his plan was for me to stay, you know, stay close to home. Um, so being to have that, that opportunity, being two, two hours away, close to my family, and uh, be able to play and represent Washington, D.C., uh, you know, it's a great feeling. And I'm just ready to, uh, to go in and work. How would you describe your playing style? Um, you know, I'm a versatile tackle, you know, uh, being able to play left and right tackle, but also being a big body that can, uh, that can move. And being able to play in the zone scheme, reach, reach dif defenders and get to the second level, and also be able to pull the outside and make plays. Um, so that's something I feel like I, I can bring to the table. Um, you know, for me, you know, uh, pulling is like for an offensive lineman is like scoring a touchdown. You know, you get out in space, you get to show your athleticism, and you get out there and punish people. Uh, for a minute, I thought my phone was broke for a little bit, but uh, <laughs> nah, you know, as soon as I, I looked at my agent, Andy, and I said, uh, it's a 703 number, he's like, pick it up, pick it up. The thing is Washington. I picked it up, and, uh, you know, it was Coach Gruden, and uh, it was just, uh, I mean, it's just a blessing, man. I words really can't. I can't even put a s sentences together right now. You know, I'm just I'm just so happy and excited to have the opportunity. You know, that's a lifelong dream for me. So, <laughs> not really, not really. <laughs> In some ways, does the wait make that moment that phone call sweeter? Oh, definitely, because you never know. Um, you know how the draft goes. You know, you never know when your phone is going to call. You know, there's a lot of teams that trade in and trade out, and you know, you never know. Uh, you know, one thing I. I I came to the conclusion over the last couple of months is it only takes one person to like you. You know, it only takes one person to like you. So you never know who's going to jump in front of you. And, uh, you know, one thing throughout this process, you know, since I've been in school, I've been haven't been able to watch TV and look at everybody's mock drafts and things like that. So I really just didn't know where I was going to end up. And, uh, you know, I just put it in God's hand and he landed me in the right place. What do you miss most about college? Uh, you know, a lot, you know, just uh, the friendships that I developed over the last couple of years. You know, um, you know some of the some of the guys I played played ball with at University of Virginia. You know, uh, they have daughters, and they're, you know their daughters are my goddaughter. And uh, you know, so being able to have them those friendships and those guys you can lean on. Um, you know, I definitely miss that. You know, miss my coaching staff, and you know, just being a part of the, you know the Cavaliers. You know, I always will ble bleed uh, blue and orange. What's it gonna be like playing for a first year head coach? You think like that. Uh, you know, being able to be around Coach Gruden, uh, you know, a couple of weeks ago, you know, it's definitely, you know, a calm vibe, you know, younger, younger coaching staff, you know, uh, he brings a lot of energy to the table, but also being able to play, you know, for guys like RG3 at quarterback, you know, guys that are very highly talented. And then you talk about Deshaun Jackson, who just got there. So being able to get there and, uh, you know, block for Alfred Morris and all those great pieces they have, and, uh, you know, just be a part of the Washington Redskins is just a blessing.